So this is Ubuntu on Android. This is uh, Motorola. This is just a yeah, normal. A normal Android. Yeah. The phone is an Atrix 2. Atrix 2. Okay. Yes. Uh, yeah. And when you dock it. It takes a few seconds yes. and then you get an Ubuntu session. Yes. And it is like a, not just a, uh, it's a full Ubuntu session. So yes. what, you, what you have here is like, a, you can do exactly anything you can do normally on, on, a, desktop. on a desktop. So you can install packages, remove packages, you can, um, you can do everything you want. Uh, yes. You can run all the normal Ubuntu applications, even a terminal if you want to. Uh, and also, together with this, you can run also uh, Android applications. So basically, ah. all the Android applications that are running on Android yes. will show up in here. Okay. Um, yeah, so they run at the same time together. Uh, there's also some integration uh, between the two. So for example, if you receive a text message, it will appear here in your messages. If you receive a call, it will pop up a big uh, notification and you can answer the call. So if you have like a Bluetooth uh, headphone, you can just uh, yeah. without undocking the phone. Yeah. Um, you, can, uh, you can, for example, so you can, for example, see here all your Android application and launch them, and it will appear in there. Yeah. Uh, you can all your contacts uh, that you have on the phone are available here, and just clicking on them, it will make a call to this contact. Uh, you can see here your recent calls, uh, all the videos that you take with the phone up here and here, and you can play them on the big screen. Um, what else? Uh, and I see my there's Microsoft Office running also. Uh, this is like uh, if you want to use this as a thin client. So what happens is you have like a, a server running uh, Windows applications somewhere on the internet, and you just uh, this is basically work like a remote desktop. So uh, this is like. Uh, Windows applications uh -huh. running somewhere on the cloud yeah. and you are working with them here. Yeah, so but the, you have the interface of uh, traditional office interface. Yeah, it yes, is and just like the data it's uh, somewhere. It's just okay. in, a, in a window here yes. on your desktop, okay. but it's running on a server. Okay. okay. Yeah. But everything else, I mean, this is just like a, yeah. for, uh, for using a, a Windows applications, but everything else you see here, it's running on this phone. Yeah. And uh, there is nothing, this is dock and the monitor. Yeah. The yes. The dock is just a USB yes. hub and oh. uh, ah, HDMI. So it's just connection and just no PC in the middle, nothing. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So, so where? Okay. This is now like a prototype or concept. Uh, do you? Uh, what, do you plan? When do you plan to ship something? And on which? What kind of phones? Right. So or maybe someone can download and install it. Or right. So we're working with um, uh, different uh, phone manufacturers to enable this on their phones. Um, so later this year uh, we plan to have something available with one of those manufacturers that you can buy uh -huh. so phone already released with this system they're yeah. working out of the box for developers we may release this year not sure when exactly um, an image of Ubuntu that if you have a rooted phone and you're willing to do your own hardware enablement yes. then you can put it on your phone yeah. but it's strictly for developers it's not something that you and the user can, can do so and this is a doc so you may don't need don't really need a dock you just connect it to a micro USB and it works exactly so this this phone I've got to uh to HDMI and USB, yeah. you can oh. just plug in a hub here, okay. and this can just go to okay. the screen directly, yeah. and it's oh. good to go. Um, the dock is nice because it gives it power, yeah. so yeah, it's, it's better. better. Okay. okay, thank you.